Good morning everyone, uh, welcome back to another episode of Free the Mind Adventures. Uh, this is day three here for us at Cape Melville. I uh, didn't do much filming yesterday, um, had a bit of a chill out day after getting up here. But uh, yeah, we're going to check a few things out today and see what we can get up to. But uh, check this out for a beautiful place to wake up to. campsite over there but uh, yeah stay tuned we'll um, see what we can find and get up to today Just uh, driving up the beach a bit and um, come across what looks to be a uh, aircraft wreckage. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's a World War II aircraft. I couldn't tell you what sort of aircraft it is, but um, yeah, I'll give you a look. There's not too much left of it. the uh, fuel tanks here by the looks of it looks like the wings or a wing so yeah pretty cool find Let's see what else we can see well here we are we finally found the memorial to uh, those that died in the Pearling Fleet when a big cyclone hit here in uh, on the 5th of March 19 uh, sorry 1899. Um, it's a bit of a mission to find. You've got to keep your eye out, eye out for one of the only sort of tracks heading inland on the northern part of the, the uh, Cape here, and uh, it's a bit of a walk in here as you can see it's not the tracks not clearly marked or anything but yeah this memorial was dedicated to uh they lost 50 vessels uh and there was over 300 indigenous australians killed No, if you come up this way, yeah, try and find it. It's um, pretty interesting to come and have a look at. So this is the uh, spot you're looking for for the entrance to the track that leads into the monument. Uh, I will have I will put GPS coordinates for this spot and for the plane wreck in the video. So if you're interested, just pause at that spot and grab the uh, GPS coordinates.
Thank you.